What's up YouTube? West Coast Poker Guru here. And I got another deck review for you guys. This time it's some Kim plastic playing cards. And a little bit of backstory about this deck. I got it from MERS67.com. And I was expecting a different deck, a different style deck. I don't know if he sent me the wrong one or if he just hasn't updated the photo, but here's a picture of what I was supposed to get, what I saw, what he has advertised on his webpage, and what I was expecting to get. And this is what I was sent. So as you can see, it's a completely different logo and a completely different brand. So, but I'm, I'm not complaining. I'm not going to return them. I, I don't have a official Kim deck yet in my collection. So I figured what the hell, I'm going to keep these and put them to use. Even though I know a lot of people badmouth Kim ever since the bicycle company bought, bought them out. And so I'm going to, I'm going to keep these and put them to play but it's just it wasn't what I was expecting so but I already found another seller on eBay that has the exact cards that I want with the different back to them so no harm no foul I'm gonna keep these but let's check them out and they send you two decks in a black plastic case with the Kim logo on it and the decks, I don't know if you can tell from there, but they're the same design, just slightly different in color. One of them is a darker black, and the other one is a lighter grayish color. You can see there. And let's check them out. You get your Kim ad card here. It's your standard deck of Kim playing cards, full size, not the bridge size. There's your Kim Ace of Spades. All the pips are standard. All the face number cards are standard. Court cards, pretty standard. That's your standard Kim playing card deck. Nothing special here. So you get your two jokers. I don't know if he's they're both the same but it looks like he's scratching his nose or picking his nose something like that pretty cool like I said before this is my first deck of official Kim playing cards but they feel nice they're nice and smooth they're stiff it, I could tell they're definitely gonna hold up pretty good playing poker they have that nice snap to them that you want and they hold their shape pretty well I'll do a test on this ad card here not so bad so I like these cards I'm gonna use them to play poker they're not broken in yet but I was just disappointed because he sent me the I don't know if he sent me the wrong cards but they're definitely not the ones that I ordered from his website, and they're definitely not the ones that he had pictured. So, nevertheless, I'm going to keep them. They spring pretty well, as do most Kim cards do. Nice and smooth. No choppiness. They handle great. They do have that weird plastic card smell to them. It's pretty strong as soon as you open it. But most cards have that. So here's a spread. Pretty good. Not bad. Most Kim cards spread great, so 
Overall, I like it. It's a good deck. The, the logo's kind of plain and boring. I was expecting a different design, but they are Kim cards, and there's a stack, nice and thick. So overall, they're not bad. I'm not a fan of Kim ever since they were bought out by Bicycle. Their quality went down the toilet, but also they have different... I've never liked the back design for a Kim card, just my personal opinion. I mean, it looks like a, a, a rug or a carpet or something like that, so I just didn't, never liked the back design for Kim's, but I've, I've always heard that they are the best cards you can get. And, well, before Bicycle bought the company, I should say, they were the best cards you can get. And that's pretty much it for this deck. It's a nice plastic deck. It holds its shape good, and it looks like it's going to be good for poker, so... If you like it, check it out, get yourself a couple decks, and stay tuned. Thanks for watching.